we at? We're, we're, we're in Collinsville, Illinois. My name is Chase Pipes, and we're with this Smoking Mountain Relic Room and Chasing History. We're here with our buddy Turtle Man. Yay! Live action Turtle and, Man. And he and himself, Ernie Brown Jr. And Turtle Man collects arrowheads just like we all do. And he sure loves is. history. And I mean, he is passionate about collecting artifacts. Tell us about collecting artifacts. I've been collecting artifacts since six years old. My dad gave me my first artifact. A Bill Black, a Dina Point, a little Stanley Point, a Moral Mountain Point, and just a little old Curtin Pine Tree Point. And I said, well, I'm going to go out here and find some of these rocks that look real funny. Now I just love looking for our heads. Been collecting them for 47 years now. Woohoo! Right. Now, what was the first arrowhead that you ever found? First one I ever found was a lost lake. Oh, you, are you serious? Seriously, I'm an artist. And here is arrowhead. Yes, sir. You know, it's, it's, it's kind of like them stories. You know, you bring a buddy out to the arrowhead fields. Yeah. And, you know, it's like, oh, yeah, and you think they won't find something. And you find a lost lake. It was six inches long in a biker patch. I was tagging the biker, and there it was. Oh, it scared funny. me to death. It was blue and gray. Oh, now, what's the favorite, your most favorite artifact you've ever found? Favorite one I ever found. Woohoo! Oh my god, I got so many of them. Uh, couldn't tell you, dude. I guess it, the best one I ever found was a Cumberland Point over in Springfield, Kentucky. I walked around this field, come electrical lightning thunderstorm. I mean, it was striking lightning, and I was getting ready to leave the field. There was a dirt claw there, and I seen a little black piece of flint, and I kicked it. Bust at the dirt car, and a six inch tumbling point come out of it. Solid black. I started crying. I took all the change in my pocket and wrapped it up in a napkin. I think it was like four dollars in change. I just had to have some change. You know? I stuck it in the ground where I found it at. Uh, I still have it today. Really? Yes, oh, I do. Awesome. Live action. That's the best piece I ever found. Now, one thing about Turtle Man is, is he really knows his stuff about artifacts and about collecting. I mean, he knows his stuff. They is, think I'm dumb, I mean, but I'm no. not dumb. He Turtle Man's smart. Now, listen, you know, we got some kids that are watching and, and some guys that are just starting to collect artifacts. Yeah. You know, what is some advice that you give for, you know, kids that are out collecting artifacts or, you know, for, you know, people that are just now, you know, getting into it? You know, yeah. What is some advice you give for don't go to flea markets and buy them is the number one rule because uh, 98% of them are probably going to be fake. And look for napping tools, you know, like nappers. Because they look got little flakes on them, like scratches. Flake chips around the house. Yeah, flake chips around the house. <laughs> Anything there, but other than finding arrowheads, go to the highest point in the field. And if there ain't arrowhead there and the highest point in the field, and I guess you might not be none in that field. Yeah. Second yeah. ridge off the creek. Yeah. Well, well, can you do me a favor? Now, your thing is live action, and my thing is yeah. woohoo. Can you do a woohoo with me? We got a woohoo going right? on. Woohoo! Woohoo! Live Thanks, action! Guys. Keep up with us. Hey, we got also a yeah, yeah, yeah. Every time somebody finds an arrowhead point in the field, it's getting started all over the world. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got live action. And they pick up an artifact. <laughs> 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 <laughs>